on areas flooding, prone to flooding, especially near the Big Creek Parkway along the borders of Cleveland and Parma. That's where we find News 5's Homa Bash. She is live in Homa. How's it looking out there? I can see that uh, car with a puddle. Yeah, so luckily we can tell you that we haven't had any major reports of damage in this area, but you can see there's a lot of puddling, a little bit of light flooding. Luckily, crews in Parma were out all weekend long clearing out sewer grates and gutters to make sure that these areas that are prone to flooding uh, kind of stay level. And as you can see, that rain is falling. But check out this picture from down in southern Ohio from Pike County. If you look really closely, you can see the top of a van that is completely submerged in water. ODOT sending out another reminder to drivers, do not, do not drive through that high water. Do not try to go around barricades. It is dangerous, as we all know. And if you see those down power lines, be sure to call and report them. And, and we can tell you that today, Cedar Point closing early, closing down their doors at 2 o'clock because of all this rainfall. But back out here live, luckily, we can tell you no reports of damage at this point here in Northeast Ohio. No major reports of damage, but that sideways rain is falling. You can see there's some light flooding and some areas of high water. Again, remember, do not try to drive through those and be safe out there. For now, we're live in Cleveland. Home of Bash since 5.